Hello everyone, a very short video here. This clip shows a 2S1 Vozdyka self-propelled howitzer getting targeted by Ukrainian drones. The howitzer is parked up in a tree line. Now it seems empty, and this is its hiding spot. It's visited by two drones. The first one actually misses, impacting on the trees above the howitzer. The second one is a good hit on the front of the 2S1. It's hard to tell though if this was destroyed but we can certainly say it was damaged. Here's the location here. So the howitzer was placed in this tree line shown by the marker. This was a hiding spot rather than a firing position. Zoomed out, we can see near a settlement called Petrifka, which is in Donetsk. Petrifka isn't familiar to me at all, at least I can't remember doing any videos of Russian losses near here. So let's check it on deep states. So this is south of Vuldar again. You may remember a video that a couple of days ago showing a 2S7 Pion getting hit in this region, but a little bit further south. Now, although this wasn't the um, 2S1's firing position, I have added the rangefinder tool as well to show the coverage provided. This is a short range howitzer, just 15 kilometers, but from this area, it can cover Vuladar. And here it is zoomed out, so you can see that this took place on the southern front. Here's an image of a 2S1. It entered service in the 1970s, and it's actually based on the MTLB chassis mounted with a 2A18 howitzer. It fires 122mm rounds. There are 92 of these listed up on Oryx so far. Russia had 230 in service last year, but we also have some in reserve as well. So that's it for this video. Hope you found it interesting. If so, please click like and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. Thanks so much and take care everyone.